What's going on guys? So today I'm going to be showing you what I'm going to be doing to the Mustang. Apart from the air raid intake, I got a few extra little goodies for the Mustang. One of them is going to be for performance again, and the other one is just for the looks. I think I'm going to show you that one first. It's probably going to be a little difficult to get it on because this is going to be my first time vinyl wrapping. There we go. The shark mouth. This one's the more detailed version. I'll put a link to their website in the description. <laughs> I think it's gonna look awesome. Here are the eyes for ya. Pretty mad. Palm Beach Dino Tune. This is gonna make us a little bit faster. I don't know what, how much, since I'm naturally aspirated and I only have a few tasteful mods, but I think it'll put a smile on my face even more than what it does right now. Take off some fender badges, put them on a shark mouth. All right guys, so we're gonna start taking off this 5.0 badging. I don't know why this below sticker's there restating that it's a 5.0 V8, but whatever. And for this fishing line, some goo gum and a microfiber towel. That's all you're gonna need for taking off the badges. Well, you need heat gun too. Heat it up, the fish line behind it, and then goo gum the rest of the goo out of it. Put on wax and grease remover on each side it's, uh, by duplicolor. Do that and then you're, you're pretty much ready to start putting on that decal. Back in the day when it was just a dream Now look at me on top of the mountain Hey y'all, so some tips for tucking this and putting the vinyl on. What I did with mine, I'm gonna get a light for y'all. So I started at the, the wheel well. Started at the wheel well and I tucked it in a little bit. So here, I'll show you. So a bit dirty, been driving around. But tucked it actually behind and up into there. As you can see, it ripped off right there a tiny bit, but it's still sticking really good. So it's actually going around and then inside just a tiny bit. So after you get it to stick there and a little bit behind, you get that heat gun, heat it up a little bit, and then press it down even more so. And then you should be set. You actually just kind of let this set first for just a, a tiny bit. And then you can start slowly but surely going and going further back. It'll be easier as you go further back because it's less to put on, as you can see. The door slit right here. Be sure to go like straight down the middle in between the gap or else you're gonna have it be off in some places just a little bit as like right here. I don't know if you can see that, but it's just a little bit more white and that's because I got more close to this side. So just be sure to try and keep that razor in the middle of the door. After you pull back the backing from it and set it down, just make sure to get all those bubbles out of there. Uh, all the wrinkles that you might get up top here. If you get bubbles and wrinkles somewhere a little bit back, it's okay to pull it off a tiny bit and then push it back on and work those bubbles and wrinkles out.
for it being my first time ever wrapping, it looks fine to me. There's a tiny bit of imperfections, like there's one wrinkle right here. That's actually about it on this side. Uh, as for the other side, same damn thing. Just uh, peel back ever so slightly, measure when you're doing the other side, make sure that it's about the same. What I did is I actually measured from here, the up top to here, like right when it was starting to get this flat piece above there. And then it's right by the body line. Ooh, that's actually off by like quarter of an inch. It's off by quarter of an inch, <laughs> but I don't care. It's not like you're gonna go to a car show and be like, is it, is it equal? Let's get out the freaking measuring tape. Is this guy equal? Nah, he sucks. But all right, so first time did pretty good, if I do say so myself. If you have any trouble, just uh, put it in the comments or get a professional. <laughs> also, I want to include that it's actually been a month since I put these on. I've just been doing the other videos like the 5.0 reveal, so go check that one out. 5.0 going into the wagon, it's gonna be pretty sick. And then we also finished up on the Crown Vic series, so. Didn't really finish up. We still have some things to add on to it. And I mean, nothing's technically finished on our channel. But uh, yeah, it's had probably about five washes stuck on there. It's, it's good. 